Hey, how's it going guys? Zeta here. So I wanted to share my first impressions on Astrobot. So I finally got an opportunity playing a little bit of it. And anyway, I'm just going to be straight up and just going to say it. This so far I have experienced, there was not even, oh, like there was not even one negative part about this game that I disliked. It's just insane. The amount of the inventive platformer, such an intriguing kind of direction that they went with this game as well. Oh man, such a treat. It's just a delight. One of the most innovative platformers of all time, I personally think, and perhaps it might be my favorite platformer of all time on top of that. So it also just builds on PlayStation's history rather than relying on it and that what makes it so much more intriguing. And it's just a delight to find these secrets and just collecting them while seeing it and also interacting with it. Like it's not just that the PlayStation history of the consoles and equipment for example that was done in the Astro's Playroom but in Astro's Bot there's just variety includes as well as characters that are very famous IPs from the PlayStation history and of course one of the biggest and notable ones that I've experienced such as like God of War, Horizon, just many other titles and on top of that they also utilize the best of efforts and abilities of these IPs such as like as an example God of War and introducing it within Astrobot. Such a delight, I absolutely love this game. On top of that while you're going through these quite varied and level designs what I absolutely adore is the fact that when you get a new ability for your Astrobot, you do not get overly complicated in terms of how to utilize this thing, this ability. And it doesn't say like one ability comes to you, right, as an example, but then when you go to a different level area, then you will lose that ability. And sometimes, occasionally, there could be a different ability. Sometimes there could be similar abilities that you use before in different level areas. I like that. It basically means that it will only cater for one particular ability per level when you're playing through this game. I like that because it doesn't get overly complicated and it makes things easier. Now, I'm not like looking for an easier experience within this game, like I mentioned. What I am looking for, an innovative platformer, and this is it. This gives it that. There's so many plenty of fun interactivities that you can have, and quite a lot of gimmicks that aren't even overused, and I really appreciate this. And also, a large collection of levels full of secrets to explore and secrets to find and so many intriguing, beautifully world done that has been uh, introduced within Astrobot. Bouncy and yet charming soundtrack and very, quite a lot of varied included there as well. Some of them a little more inspired and some of them more traditional Astrobot music and some of them are actually kind of pop and hip-hop style too. I was quite pleasantly surprised. <laughs> and just makes it a beautiful, creative and a great use of dual sense controllers features, haptic feedback, uh, of course it just makes it the best game to experience your PlayStation 5 controller. My goodness, I absolutely love it. The power-ups I like mentioned already with the abilities that are fun to play with and different diversities and different varieties. It just makes it such an, uh, an amazing time to be going through this game. And I personally think I would be doing this game a disservice if I do not go for that Platinum Trophy. Because mind you, I'm going through this game, I'm 100%ing every single level that I go through. and even though there's some uh, specific areas that could be a little bit challenging, but they're not like frustrating. And yet when you do achieve that, you know, you go through it and you're successful and then you're like looking back at it, man, this was pleasant. This was so satisfying. This was so much fun. And really this game achieves that in every metric. I absolutely adore this game. 10 out of 10 masterpiece so far that I've experienced. I cannot wait to give you guys my full review, of course, after when I achieve the Platinum Trophy for Astrobot, because I feel that my thoughts are not going to change. In fact, I think they may even elevate. And oh, I cannot wait to share my thoughts about this, guys. I'm very much looking forward to it. 
Thank you so much for watching, like and subscribe. See you guys all and have a wonderful day.